Hello United fans. United sent clear message about Lenny Euro causing same problems as Garnacho. But before we get to details, let's catch up on some updates first. Sir Alex Ferguson praises young stars Mainu and Garnacho, calling them the heart and soul of the club. He highlights their composure, confidence and courage, seeing them as foundational players for Eric Ten Hag's team. Eric Ten Hag confirmed United's interest in De Ligt, but clarified he hasn't pushed for the transfer, despite previous interest. The focus remains on new signing Lenny Euro. Future defensive signings, including De Ligt, remain uncertain. United has reportedly agreed on personal terms with PSG's Manuel Ugart, but a transfer fee is still pending. Ugart's comments about wanting to stay at PSG and his inconsistent play last season might signal potential issues for United if they proceed. New United signing Lenny Euro, who joined from Lille for £52 million, credits club legend Rio Ferdinand with influencing his decision. Euro admired Ferdinand and Raphael Varane, and Ferdinand's insights helped him choose United over other top clubs. Eric Ten Hag praised Arne Slot's appointment as Liverpool's manager, calling it great for Dutch football. Despite a past comment downplaying Slot's achievements with Feyenoord, Ten Hag looks forward to their upcoming matches in the Premier League and pre-season. Scott McTominay could leave Manchester United this summer, with Galatasaray interested in the £25 million midfielder. His departure is linked to United's £58.8 million deal for Manuel Ugart. Ugart's arrival could prompt further changes in United's midfield. United might target Arsenal's interest, Martin Zubay Mendy, if they can't sign PSG's Manuel Ugart. With Casemiro possibly leaving, United agreed on terms with Ugart, but have Zubay Mendy as a backup option. The club remains active in the transfer market. Eric Ten Hag acknowledges Ralph Rangnick's claim that Manchester United needs open-heart surgery, admitting they are still far from winning Premier League titles. He stresses that despite progress, the club's standards and culture must improve significantly to achieve long-term success. Man United is planning a substantial offer to sign PSG's Xavi Simons, valued between £50.6 million and £60.2 million. Alongside pursuing Ugart and De Ligt, they aim to leverage Eric Ten Hag's Dutch connections. Competition from Bayern Munich adds pressure. Now let's delve into the main news of the day. Manchester United boss Eric Ten Hag has received reassuring news about new signing Lenny Euro from the youngster's former coach. The highly rated 18-year-old defender was signed from Lille for up to £59 million, beating out Real Madrid for his signature. Despite the high price tag, fans might have to wait a bit to see him in action. Former Lille manager Jocelyn Gervenek, who gave Euro his debut, praised the defender's humility and willingness to learn. Gervenek believes Euro will adapt smoothly and not cause issues, unlike Garnacho, who had a rocky start under Ten Hag. Young players sometimes think they don't have much to learn and don't listen, Gervenek told Sky Sports. It's not like that with Lenny. He's eager to learn and listens well, which helps him go far. This will be a relief for Ten Hag, who had challenges with Garnacho. The Dutch manager took his time integrating Garnacho, who, at the same age as Euro, had attitude issues early on. Garnacho arrived late for pre-season twice, causing tensions. In April, Garnacho liked social media posts criticizing Ten Hag's substitutions, leading to a public reprimand. However, Gervenek's comments suggest Euro will be a more cooperative addition to the squad. Euro debuted at 16 and made 60 appearances for Lille, scoring three goals. He might make his United debut in the pre-season match against Rangers. United will be looking to bounce back after their 1-0 loss to Rosenborg, with upcoming games against Arsenal, Liverpool and the Community Shield against Manchester City. If you enjoyed this video and found it useful, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and give it a thumbs up. Stay tuned.